through uh, a hypothetical, an idea, something that kind of started uh, trending a little bit yesterday. And I thought the video came out yesterday. The one that I saw that was posted on Mike Tyson's account was was posted yesterday, but it may have come out last week. Who knows? Either way, is it possible that we are seeing a Mike Tyson comeback? No. I, I don't know. Because Evander Very. Holyfield is coming back to fight... Uh, I don't think it would be a professional. Uh, I'm, you're not going to see Tyson against Tyson Fury. You're not going to see Tyson against Deontay Wilder. I think if you've got like an exhibition format thing, 100%. I mean, we. Gary. Did we ever talk about this about uh, uh, Big John Fury like calling out Mike Tyson, saying, I want to fight him for charity? Like it's a three round, whatever. That, did, you, did we talk about that? No. No? Okay. Well, that that happened a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. When Mike Tyson shared this video out, Tyson Fury's dad shared that out. The exact same video got shared out yesterday, and it said, I'm back. Gary, that is 100% after the Jordan doc. Agreed. I, That's I know all he did from. was he's just doing what Jordan did just for a, just for a hit. Right, but he he's released like four or five different training videos. Training yeah, videos. He's, he's getting back in shape. Uh, yeah, he's right. an old man. He wants to stay in shape. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. But you don't think he's coming back? You don't. You don't think he's going to fight again? I don't know what to think on this man. I think he's crazy enough to do it. Now, I I will say this: I don't think he should. At fifty three years old, I mean, you could really get injured in there. Like, and and he has not been in the best of shape over the past however many years. I mean, obviously. At the end of his career, back in 05, 06, whatever it was, when he was fighting at some in point in time, these guys have to be able to pass some type of psychological exam before somebody can sanction the fight. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Matt said this isn't Rocky Five, Rocky Nine. Rocky fights the nurses of the retirement home. Like, like you asked if we wanted to talk about this yesterday, and I was like, "What are you talking about? That video's been out for a couple of weeks. Like, I don't know what you're talking this, about." This and was a new I one that was posted. The, I saw the "I'm back" thing, and I was like. He, he literally just ripped off Jordan's. It's just like a, it's just a thing that he did. Like a lot of people did an I'm back thing. I tell me this. Would you pay to watch him fight? No. If he came back? I would not. I'm, I would be very curious. Now, I would if, try to see it for free. I would maybe try to bootleg it after, after the fact, but I would not pay money for that. No, I don't think I would either. I'll, I'll tell you this after paying money for the, for the, the Floyd Mayweather, um, McGregor fight, I, I I will not pay money for a spectacle again. Yeah, I can understand that. I uh, I can understand that. I mean, it, it, Mayweather McGregor was entertaining, but no, it wasn't. That, no, it was. It wasn't entertaining at all. I thought it was relatively. No, no, entertaining. no, it wasn't. It was the most boring thing we've ever watched McGregor do ever. Not Mayweather. I'll but agree. McGregor, I'll agree with yes. that. It's the most boring thing I've ever watched McGregor do. Yeah. Now, you, you have a very valid point there. But it, here's the thing. McGregor was fighting for nothing. Uh, and that's, that's kind of the issue here. Like, when you've got boxers that are fighting for nothing, that are, that are not going for a title, that are not doing whatever, it loses, it loses a little bit of that value. So what do you think the Tyson fight's going to be? And that's, that, that's the issue. That's why I said I wouldn't pay for it. Like, none of these would be for fighting for something. And that's... So the UFC tries to make a, a gigantic deal about... Every fight has to mean something, right? That's why they have so many different title fights. Like it, they Ferguson don't. But they, and, don't. They, what? don't. they don't. They're bad at that. Oh, they are bad at that. But that, that's what they try to do is they try to make everything matter. And in, in a sense, it works. But I don't know. I mean, we all know that Habib is like the 155 champ, right? Well, then why in the world do we have... Justin Gaethje and Tony Ferguson fighting for the interim belt. Like, you know, and Gaethje threw it on the ground afterwards. Like, the whole thing's goofy. But, yeah, like, as far as Tyson goes, at, I mean, it would be it would be interesting, I think, to see what he does. But, I mean, you have a very valid point. I, <laughs> I, I thought when it was, uh, when it popped up yesterday... And it became like this big trending thing. That video's been trending for a week or so. Well, I mean, it popped back up again. 
Yeah, because he reshared it out again with a new type title. Well, there you Everybody's go. Everybody's just trying to ride Jordan's jock, man. He's just he's no different than Penny. All right, uh, Pippin. <laughs> I was about to say, wait, just, what? Just trying, just trying to, just trying to ride Jordan's jock. That's it. I am with you. I don't know right. that you are. I don't know that you no, are. No, I, I understand where you're coming from. How's that? Because I can understand where you're coming from, even if I disagree. But I don't think I disagree that much. Like I'm, I'm still on the same side that you are. Like I, I don't think he should come back. But I don't know. James Tony came out and said that he's wanting to get back in shape to start fighting, et cetera, again. So we'll see. It is what it is. Let's jump into this last topic here. 